Hello friends, welcome to Challenge Farm. Boy, we are we are running low on time. We have really enjoyed this challenge. I'm not sure. <laughs> we gotta check the bats. Please, bats. 2% apple, please. Uh all the other fruits, by the way, are 3.6% if they're from a fruit tree. <clears throat> and uh the apples are just low on the the uh, RNG poll there. So, what interesting things do we get up to today? I'm not sure. What do we got going on? Good humor. Well, we could go back. Could go back to the mines. The mines. The mines. They call to me. This is an amazing gift. Oh, well, I'm so glad that you like it. Right. We have nothing to farm because uh, we're out of time. Although, we could maybe, we could maybe do fiber seeds if I have enough stuff to make a bunch more. And honestly, I'm not sure if I do. I might? Hmm. I should really look into that, I think. Can we just plant a whole mess of fiber seeds? Do we get another coop or something? I don't know. I don't know. Maybe we just try to get more bat wings and uh, get more butterfly things on the farm. <laughs> It'll be hard to hard to say no to that, right? Surely. Surely it would be. Indeedy. Hello, animals. Hello, 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 hello. All right, just go next door and pet everybody. Uh, as soon as we throw some stuff in here. All right, what don't we need? I'll sell that stuff, sell that stuff. Sell that as well. Very nice. Animals, would you like a snail as a gift? I have one in my hands right now. You can totally enjoy it. No? You don't? Oh, I'm, I'm, I'm stunned, really. I'm shocked. Look at all these fruit trees we got. That's pretty great. Oh, the dog just gave us clay? Whoa! Doggo gives gifts? That's cool. What does the cat give you? Probably nothing. It's a cat. They probably take something from your inventory. You just taunt me. Pierre shakes fist at the sky. How dare you, Pierre? Please, bats. Uh, not even a plum? Man, tough crowd. Tough crowd. Fruit bats are slacking over there. Right, let's toss all that there. And yeah, let's go put some things away. And first off, this needs to go here. And second off, these need to go over there. Oh, very good. Drop you off. Drop those off. Drop these off. I got a snail to drop off. We got some syrup to drop off. Okay. What was I going to try to make? Hmm. There was something. What was it? <laughs> um... <laughs> Uh, er, hmm. Yeah, there was definitely something. What do I not? Ha I don't have any diamonds. No, well, not my inventory anyway. Hmm. Ah, the old geode crusher. No, we don't need any of that. The sturdy ring. I'm sturdy. All right, I don't think we need any of that stuff. Uh, don't need any of that, I don't think. A cookout kit creates a cooking campfire. Let you cook on the go. Yeah, okay. Well, it's nice and all. Mini jukebox. Oh, wow, that's actually not that expensive to make at all. 
Stone signs, dark signs, signs everywhere, here, here, there, there, here, here, there, there. We can make 24 more, really? Uh, that's pretty great. That's pretty tempting, actually. That's pretty tempting. Hang on, how much iron do we have in here? Not a lot. All right, well, I know what we're doing today. We need iron. So, let's... Oh, fiber seeds! Oh, I remembered. <laughs> Sorry for the exclamation there. Fi that's a grass starter. Uh, fiber, see fiber. Aha! Oh, yeah. Nice. We can make quite a bit of them. Let's, uh, let's say right about there. Okay. And we don't need to worry about watering anything because, you know, they don't need to be watered. So, this is actually pretty smart. And then, what do we do? Do we just not harvest it till spring? It'll just sit there, right? Since you can grow them in any season. And then we don't have to worry about, like, our land out here. Oh, I might be a genius. This might be the way. This might be how you would beat the system in a longer playthrough, friends. Although, I'm not sure how much we can cover with this many seeds, but I'm going to guess it's at least this area, right? And watering or not watering should make zero difference to these seeds. So the fact that some of these squares aren't watered really shouldn't impact this at all. And we're going to get a lot of fiber from this. I like fiber. Fiber is friend. Fiber is friendly. Fiber is fun. Fiber helps you relieve pressure. I don't know. I don't know what fiber does for your digestive tract. I know it does something. It does something for your digestion. Do I know what it is? No. No, I don't. I really... Mm, I have no idea. Um, obviously, I'm not someone who eats a lot of it on purpose. <laughs> If I don't even know what it does for you. I know sometimes it's good to have some. That's the extent of my fiber knowledge right there. That's it. That's, that's all I've got. All right. Well, I guess anywhere that we can plant that's sort of like, you know, uh, in, a, in a grouping is helpful. I got four left. All right, well, there you go. So I would have had to have made, like, even more. That's crazy. That is a lot. That would be a lot of... A lot of fiber seeds. Even more than we even have already, which I don't want to deal with that many. That's, that's, that's too much. It's too much. It's too much fiber. Is what it is. Far too much fiber. All right, what do we got? Oh, winter root. What about over here? What are you? Are you something fun? What do you got? An X thing. Okay, cool. What about you? Oh, winter root. I have to admit, none of that was especially exciting for me. Ooh, what are we doing? We're dancing. Oh, it's Harvey's uh, exercise event. Let's go. Yeah, shake it, Harvey. You got this. Wave those weights in the air. Wave them like you just don't care. That's right. All right, that concludes our aerobics class. Are you breaking a sweat? Were we sweating to the oldies? <laughs> uh, yeah. Oh, Doc. Doc, you need to exercise more. I do, too. I, I really shouldn't talk. No! Max, you were watching me? How embarrassing. I didn't want anyone to know, least of all you. I, I, to be fair, I feel like I was watching half the town. Just trying to stay healthy as you get older, it requires more effort. That is true. I'm not in very good shape, though. I can hardly keep up with them. Look, don't tell everyone in town that I'm doing dance aerobics, okay? Well, I, I'm not going to say anything. Thanks, Max. Appreciate that. I don't why I don't know why you would care, but 
Hey, Louis. You know, we were going to check with Pierre. Do you like fried eel? That's very kind of you. Okay. I do all my grocery shopping here. Louis, we are not best friends. How about now? No, we're still not. Okay. Well, that's good to know. <laughs> I was hoping. I gave you a, a rabbit's foot. One of my rabbits only has three feet now. How could you not love me? Probably because you took a foot from your rabbit, hill hum. <laughs> Just saying. Just saying that that's probably a, a good part of it, you know? That's... <laughs> that's all. <laughs> okay, we need iron. So here we go. Let the search for iron commence. None of that was iron. I could use more rock, though, so, you know. Oh, there's one. Okay, we got one. Aha! Yes. Lovely. Oh, and more bat wings. Perfect. Do like a good bat wing. Gotta make more butterfly hutches around here. You can never have too many butterflies, can you? I mean, probably at some point you could have too many. I have not hit that point yet, obviously. Excuse me, slime friend. Oh. By the time you find this, you'll have been living in the valley for some time. Monitor continuing the family tradition and through that noble endeavor, bringing greater life and abundance to Stardew Valley. A place dear to my heart. Keep up the hard work, the good work, Grandpa. I hid a very special secret for you somewhere in the valley. You might think of it as a compendium of my greatest discoveries. When you're ready, you'll find it. Well, what is... Now, I'm going to want to know what that's about, but obviously we're going to wait for the other playthrough to figure it out. So, teaser hashtag. Hashtag teasers. <laughs> Minor spoilers, I guess, too. Sorry. <laughs> Sorry about that. I can't really control what the game gives me here, you know? I just want iron. That's all. That's all I want. I did not expect there to be more secret notes, quite frankly. That was not a part of the update that I anticipated. Wow, three frozen tears. Really? That's fascinating. Is that an updated drop? I don't remember ever getting three frozen tears from one of those uh, barrel things before. Ooh, there are a lot of bouncing friends. Hello, Dust Sprites. How are you today? Thank you so much for your kind donations of coal. Because of your hard work, we can now afford one more beehive. That means we can make 25. Excellent. If we, you know, used it for that purpose, obviously. Which we might not. I'm just, you know. But that would be enough for one more. Yeah, all right. We're out of that floor. We don't want no copper, okay? We just want iron. What is that from? Iron without. Iron within. Oh, that's uh, that's that's Warhammer 40k. Oh, that's like the evil Warhammer 40k guys, actually. I'm pretty sure that's like Chaos Marines. Anyway. <laughs> pretend you didn't hear that good Imperial citizen. Otherwise, the Inquisitors will have to speak with you, and that never goes well for anyone. Just saying. Nothing like getting some iron. 22. Okay. Well. You know, it's a start. That's another four bars. That's better than zero new bars, right? Where I live, it seems like there's constantly old bars closing and new bars opening. Speaking of bars, but that's a different kind of bar entirely. The only kind of bar I think I will never have to worry about in my life is the bar exam. Because I don't ever plan on taking any, uh, like, you know, legal classes. So, you yeah, know, pretty sure I'm not going to have to worry about that one. Also, I think that test would be incredibly stressful. Just saying. 
not something I would be excited about, I don't think. A lot of hard work goes into that. That looks like a big... What is that? Wood is in there? Is that like stacks of wood or something? That's what it looks like. Hey, we got a dwarf scroll. Nice. It's worth a whole 1G. Oh, another three frozen tears. Okay. You know, you would think on a decent luck day like today, I mean, you know, luck was good today, that uh, we'll be finding staircases and ore a little bit more frequently than we are. Ah, my friend has finished playing Pacific Drive. What an interesting looking game that is. That's on the maybe list, by the way. Um, there does seem to be a little bit of upgrade, I don't want to say inventory tedium, but uh, maybe content that would be harder to make entertaining. I think that might be one of those edit this down sort of moments where you're like, okay, so we got the upgrades for this and blah, blah, blah. So I made those and put them on. Let's go explore again. And I think probably that's how you would have to do that. Just because I don't know that anyone's going to want to watch an episode of, of me spending a half an hour <laughs> messing around with upgrading a, a random uh, things f to put on the car or whatever. I just, I don't. I don't see that as being uh, riveting content if I were to do that game, let's just say. That's all I'm saying. All right, ghost. And stab. Beautiful. I do love being able to stab me some ghosts in this game and also some slimes. I just... The little dagger. I have grown to love it. I did not initially love it. It took it took some convincing. Okay, it took it took, uh, took a little work. It took took some using it and all that. But uh, I think now at this point, I think I would say with with, with a decent amount of uh, confidence that I do really enjoy the dagger. Would I want to use it exclusively? No. But I do enjoy having it as an option. Just every once in a while, it's nice for just some really focused, like, super damage, you know? That's all I'm saying. Okay, we have some friends. Hi there. And there's iron here. Beautiful. Ghost needs to go away. We don't care about whatever you have. Uh, so I think it's just solar essence, which pretty sure I got a few hundred of those laying around. So it's not nearly as important as bat wings. I'll tell you that right now. Bat wings are like the most important thing. A jade. Ooh, what do I not need? Honestly, probably I don't probably need that scroll at all. We already have them, of course. The museum is a complete head. So we don't need it for that. This is a really good floor, by the way, to grind in and out on. Uh, it's level 55. You can just hop there from the, the elevator. Very easy to get to. Aha! More emeralds. Very good. I see some quartz over here. That's nice. And, oh, there's an amethyst up there. Do I, do I have room for amethyst? And the answer is no. All right, what do we toss so that we can have the amethyst? Uh, probably the sap. Yeah, we have a ton of, ton of sap, so that's fine. I hear you, bat. Thank you for your bat wing donation. I appreciate it. Yes, even more iron. That's what we're here for. Iron and coal. Iron and coal. Iron and coal. And gemstones. Yeah, okay, more enemies. That's fine. It is getting late. We should probably think about heading back to the house. Although, honestly... 
Do we even need to worry about it at this point in our Stardew Valley lives? What would we lose out on? Like 1k? Eh, eh, you know. <laughs> it's not really that serious of an amount of money for us. <laughs> we'll probably make that much in mayonnaise today. So, I don't know. I debate about these things in my head sometimes. Like, you know, after a certain point, why wouldn't you just pass out every day in Stardew? I mean, look, we made, what, like four times what we would have lost? We still would have made plenty of money. It's not like we lose out on items, right? We don't, we don't just drop items. Here you go, friend. An amazing gift. On Fridays, I stay quiet. Yes, we know. Okay, what do we got going on? Queen of Sauce, stir fry. Okay. Fortune teller, very unhappy. Uh oh. Weather reports clear and sunny for the winter star. Hooray. And now we can get all these. And also, we can go down here. And I think I already have a jade in my inventory, so we can get all of these as well. Look at that. Now we're thinking with brain power. Use the little gray matter between your ears, he'll help. That's what it's there for. Drink the tasty beverages. Yes, the beverages. And eat the delicious food. And realize there's no diamonds to be had. Ring the crystal and look downstairs. What do we got? Nope, nothing exciting. Alrighty. Oh, hello. Tomorrow's the feast. Don't forget about Clint. Okay, I will give him a gemstone. I'm pretty sure that's fine. Pretty sure we'll be okay. What do we do with these ghost fish? I don't know. I could probably just sell them, honestly, but... You don't have any regular ones? Really? If I was this cave carrot... I'd be in there. Okay. Lovely. Ugh. Give me my cheese back. Need some cheese. And we drop off the refined. Court says we have a hundred. <laughs> oh, man. That's a lot, actually. That is a lot. That is a lot of refined quartz just sitting there. <laughs> You could probably make a pretty good amount of money selling a bunch of those. <laughs> oh, jeez. Oh, that's funny. I hear you, Paparuski. I hear, I hear you. I hear you. All right. So, these are done. That's done. Oh, even more iridium, you say. Well, how very kind of you, game. Look at this. The game is also kind. We got more geodes. I like it. I like it a lot. I don't know. Where is the dog? I heard the dog, but I, didn't, I don't think I saw the dog. Hello, animal friends. Hello. Hello, 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 hello. Alright, what's in here? We have delicious, amazing resources. Even more goat cheese. That's what we have. And we say hello to everybody in here as well. Hello, 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 hello. Alright, what do we got? Ooh, dino egg. Well then. The double, the double large. Whew. Hey, so you guys want to know a funny story? I mean, funny not haha, but like funny like, wow, that was crazy. Uh, I bought gas today, and uh, the auto shut off did not shut off, like, at all. And so, you know, gas, like, waterfalled out of my gas tank. I was not very excited about that. I'm not sure what the opposite of excited is. I was that. Uh, I wasn't, like, upset or, or scared or panicking or anything of that nature, but... I was not happy about it, I'll tell you that much. I was decidedly not happy about it. Uh, you know, I don't, I don't, can't speak for you, but, um, you know, I'm not a big fan of, like, 
pouring a bunch of volatile fuel onto the ground under my vehicle. Anyway, so I had to go inside and inform the nice uh, employee that that had happened and that the pump had an auto shut off. And I'm not really sure what that means for my vehicle, actually, quite frankly. Um, does it mean anything good? Does it mean anything bad? I really don't know. I'm not. I'm not sure. Right? Do we have? What are we work? Oh yeah, a thousand pieces of wood. Um. I mean, we should be able to go do that without any problems. Sure. You know what? Let's actually buy a ticket to the desert. The rarity of rarities. <laughs> rarity of rarities. Let's go. Excellent. Oh, look, moss. Uh, why would moss be in the desert? Can I... Oh, okay, you can use your sword. Oh, sword. Use your sword, Hilhelm. Get for yourself the moss. Uh, we're probably not going to use it for anything, but it's, you know, it's cool to see it. And, uh... That is certainly a thing that will be useful in the other playthrough. What about over here? We got any... Got any exciting moss over here? Oh no! We took out two trees! I was overzealous in my swinging. Wow, look at the... We learned that you can get moss in the desert. That is interesting. What about this? Oh yeah! That's way smarter. Just use the... Just use the stabby dagger, Hilhom. That probably would have been better. Instead of losing a bunch of seeds. Okay, well, we need a thousand wood. So, let's let's just get on that, shall we? I don't think it'll take that long to get to. Should be able to go right there and then it'll fall the other way. Plus, you know, I'm sure we'll be able to come up with a use for a thousand wood for something. Oh, ho, what is this? Hello? Carrots. Okay. Well, we're just finding all sorts of fun stuff, aren't we? Also, did you notice that the, the trees drop coconuts? I don't know if they all will, but... Yeah, we're getting coconuts from the trees. Interesting. Okay, we're at 398. Not bad. Probably could have made that one fall the other way. It would have been smarter. Yes, come to me, beautiful acorns. All right, I guess now we're working on maples, okay. But every tree is roughly 25 wood, right? 24, somewhere in there. But every five trees should be about 100 wood, is what I'm trying to say. So if that's the case, then, in order to get to a thousand, you know, probably about... What would that be? Five is a hundred, so five times ten would be, what, about fifty, I guess? About fifty trees? It is super easy to do with this upgraded axe, I'll tell you that much. Can you imagine trying to do it without the upgraded axe? Oh my gosh. Close could I get to? There we go. We managed to get them all. I'm not sure how you would if you didn't have like an iridium band or like a super magnet ring or something. I like how the posts sort of stick through the trees there. That's kind of funny. We got 
Uh, Buck, what is a secret? Well. What does that do for us? Felled trees have a 5% chance to yield double wood? Okay, sure. <laughs> we'll, we'll take that on. I don't have any problems with adding that to our repertoire here in this playthrough. I don't really think it'll, you know, change things drastically for us one way or the other. Can't put it there, huh? Interesting. Or there? Okay. Alright, back to these. Here we go. Gotta line it up. Line it, line it up, up, up. Oh. Just put all the trees back where they go. Gonna replant our our deforestation issues. Hey, no, go. I know you go there. Really, you don't? You won't go in that spot, huh? Interesting. And uh, we have some lovely maple trees that we can put down. Oh, which we will do uh, without complaint. Okay, and then over here where we accidentally removed some trees, uh, we should probably put a couple back. <laughs> Feels bad otherwise, you know what I'm saying? Uh, yeah, yeah, that's that's unfortunate otherwise. <laughs> it's on me, it's on me. Uh, can we squeeze one in here? What about here? Okay. Um, and then, uh, I don't know, maybe over here we put a couple, just for giggles and fun. And we, why, why can't we put any, that is so weird. I don't know what it is about this row that won't let you. Huh. Interesting. Well. Okay, I guess, I guess we go over here then and we expand on this side. And use the rest of our seeds. Very all right. Well, we have twenty-four moss. Um, I don't know what to do with it. Quite honestly, I think probably we'll just put it in a chest. Cause I, I have little actual use in this playthrough for that. Um, you know. Also, we got a ton of sap there. Do you see three hundred and six? Six more six. We already have like stacks of it. Stacks. Look at this. Stacks. <laughs> oh man. I guess I put it in there. Uh, you know. Uh, again, I'm not sure where else to. I'm not sure where else to put things. All right. Well, there we go. Put all that away. Beautiful. Lovely. Was it anybody's birthday? Ooh, I bet that was yesterday. I bet our southern neighbor's birthday was yesterday and we skipped it. Oh, I did. Are we best friends, though? Does it matter? Are we at eight hearts already? Maybe. It's possible. No. Oh, that really would have helped. Well, perhaps she is in the saloon. Leah, are you in the saloon? Oh, friend to the south with the... Red locks that are amazing. Makes my heart palpitate. Are you in the saloon? So also I heard, and I I, I have not for science to this, but... Uh, NPCs will not walk through chests anymore. This looks delicious. Nothing quite like a fresh salad. That is true. Spilled a whole bucket of milk on the floor today. It was horrible. A waste of Belinda's hard work. You know what you need? You need a cookie. Here you go. <laughs> Harvey's here. Hey, Harvey. Have a coffee. It's my favorite stuff. It's like you read my mind. 
Yeah, you know, I'm good like that. Willie and I are maxed. Clint, how are we doing? Six out of ten. Okay, that's that's not encouraging. Shane, I think I think we're good, right? Yep. Yeah, I've grown attached to Marty and Jazz. We're a ragtag bunch, but it kind of feels like a weird family. Well, good for you. I know Pam and I are best friends. Gus, best friends, yeah. Glad to see you. Always welcome. Oh, well, thank you. Uh, Clint, I, I know you like, you know, gemstones, but have some spaghetti. This is a fun gift. Thanks. No problem. Hope you enjoyed that. All right, anything else in anybody's uh, garbage cans here that are like... Is there anything exciting and new <laughs> that I want to mess with? Oh, we got a ticket. I got a ticket. Well then. So, a ticket, huh? Lewis, how the dickens did you... I thought you were just at the... Okay, whatever. Alrighty. Well... We will take the bait, I guess. There's a bed in there? Oh, interesting. Hey, what does this bait do exactly? Although, those are mixed flower seeds. I thought that was bait. Plant them and see what grows. Huh. Well, it's winter time. What the heck was that thing? Was that the possum? Uh... What? <laughs> I'm not sure what that was. I think that's what it might have been, but I am not 100% sure. Oh, well, we got those. That's fun, I guess. I'm really liking this bonus speed thing that we bought, by the way. Oh, our last spot. Ooh, the last spot. Ooh. Okay, so is there anything in here that we can take out? That I don't need. Um, no, not, not really. <laughs> okay. Well, we do have an iridium cherry. I guess we can. We can probably sell that. I don't think. I don't think we're gonna do a lot with the iridium cherry. And there we go. Okay. Uh, so, yeah, we should be, if we move the one up and then make some more of those, we should be able to get a good chunk more beehives done. Right then. More iron. Okay, well, well, we did what we could there, that's for sure. We have one left exactly. <laughs> Which, you know, if you think about it, is not a lot, but we are low on it. We are low on... on everything really except iridium and uh refined quartz you know can i just i think we're just gonna sell half of them i don't need them for anything and i'm curious how much they're worth how much does 50 refined quartz make us i don't know we're about to find out all right friends three episodes left at most probably two probably what we'll do is we'll play the next two normal and then the second one we'll do one extra day so we can see grandpa's results for us and also uh take those pesky apples over <laughs> just to have the satisfaction of dropping them off in the community center and uh i don't know that we'll watch the event for the community center finishing but uh because I feel I don't feel like we've earned watching the event because we didn't get the apples in time. I just want to have the visceral satisfaction of putting the apples in the community center. <laughs> oh man! Oh, there, there's, there's the the man in red himself up on the sleigh, flying across the sky. Hey, 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 hey! All right, so 50, 50 gold each. That's it. <laughs> That's not, that's not worth very much. Not at all. That cherry was worth way more. <laughs> that's hilarious. Oh, man. Okay. Well, that's fun. <laughs> that's a great time. Oh, goodness. Oh, the diamonds are done. All right, everybody. Well, thanks for hanging out. I appreciate y'all very much and uh, hope you enjoy. Have a good see. Have a good week.
I was gonna say have a have a, have a good season, but I, that didn't make any sense at all. Uh, never mind. You know what? I'm tired. Okay, look. <laughs> it's just what it is. Have a great one. We'll see you next time. Take care.